Here we are, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another Coaster Spotlight Live Edition bundles. We are looking at fantasy bundles, five amazing fantasy coasters from our community of 2019 creations. So we're gonna be kicking things off with Holt. Holt, Holt, see the forest through the G's. 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 By Rad Rocket, a builder. And here they say, Holt is a compact four-seat inverted coaster that takes riders on a high speed through the forest of the giant trees. The near misses whipping past branches and the treetop villages intensifies the thrills. Oh my God, Shane Turner with a $5 tip, a little bit of support, thank he says. You. Thank you. Shane. And at the same time, Goldie with the 200 bitty cheer. Uh, Shane, Shane Turner stealing Goldie's thunder almost immediately. <laughs> thank both of you guys. <laughs> really you so appreciate much. it. Really appreciate it. This looks like okay. Pathing Nightmare. Follow uh, the Definitely. <laughs> definitely. Follow the lines. Um. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> let's just go, let's just go to the boarding station. Let's just go to the boarding right. station, or you can follow this? some of the arrows. That's the exit. That's the exit. Sun. See the forest through the G. That's nice. Holt. Ooh, I like the way you did that with the twigs. It looks awesome. Right. Malta King, you know sup, nerds. Hey. Hey. Up, this is actually the people do it from the entrance arrows back to the you know place where you should go that's how i'm uh trying to yeah there you go you see nailed it pro all right uh, okay. oh, all right inverted four seat arrival SCM yes. with the follow thank you from canada a fellow Canadian Ooh. in the house. Wow. Coaster stats, a thousand meters in length, nine inversions. This should be a looper. Great. All right, you so guys. Nice. You, Krimi, and uh, SCM Canada. Yeah, the only three of us. Yeah. I did look at YouTube. I think like 2% <laughs> of my audience is from Canada. That's pretty sad. <laughs> I'll play a tiny violin. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Yeah. Oh, I don't have sound. Oh. There we go. Fixed it. Wow, freaking wee! So? Confetti, please, Jerry! Uh, no, I was just muted. <laughs> Confetti, please, Jerry! Jerry. Thank you, Chris. Thank yep, you. with the 100 bit each year. Nice timing as well. Um, Fuu said something about the pathing. Did Fuu set this one up? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, uh, shout out to Fu as well. She set up a few of these maps for us. We Definitely. appreciate it. Um, what a coaster, I, um, indeed. That was uh, really well done. Can, is, can we get a park count on that? that I'm surprised that that's 4,000. That is sure. a lot of craziness all well, in one coaster. I love a, it. It's a temple pieces for, like, tree trunk. Oh, wow, only 2,700. Two, wow. Yeah. Uh, Wicked Broughton guys uh, left a big message just saying he joined Discord and Twitch and wants to join Patreon and has never used any of these apps before, so welcome to uh, technology. <laughs> <laughs> and thank you for your support. We appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> wow. I don't know, Fu. I don't think we changed anything. So, um, ah, well, we'll just figure it out. 
I had some issues with the the maps and with uh, the workshop yesterday. That's uh, we couldn't we didn't stream as you guys might have noticed. That's fine. Okay, uh, next up. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna be looking at Lionheart. I might like that name. Let me guess. Let me guess. What? Zelda two. Yeah. Lionheart is yep. literally my character's name in Final Fantasy, and it's a Final Fantasy creation yep. uh, by Xenatu Belmont, a legend builder. And they here they say, Squall has acquired the legendary gunblade, dubbed Lionheart. He, has, uh, he is ready to head to the Balam Garden Training Center and extract revenge on the certain Trexar. The results will be explosive. Hey, Johnny, I've been wanting to make a blueprint inspired by the f my very first RPG, Final Fantasy VIII. Okay. Uh, with the remaster just being released, it pushed me to get this creation out. That must have been two years ago. <laughs> uh, daytime seat works best. First row, second seat. Feel free to choose any of the other POVs if you like. I think we want to give this one a cinematic ride for sure. Sure. Uh, but we will do a seat view at first. Or maybe a track. Wait, what did he say? First row. Seat. Yeah, so that'll be fine. Um, yeah, that's cool. Final Fantasy VIII is a very um, controversial one because it's either people's favorites or their least favorite. I looked, I, I didn't play it, so I can't really speak on it. But I just same. didn't, I didn't like the aesthetics and I didn't like the, the, the graphics. It just felt different to me. It looked like a Resident Evil game, graphically. Um... But I love Final Fantasy. That was the one that I definitely skipped out on. They came out with the uh, Final so, Fantasy IX, right? Did I tell you that the other day? They have all the Final the Fantasies remade. remade. All of them. No, but the IX, the pixel, pixel version what? update. No, nine, nine is a 3D today. one for PlayStation. No, there was something else. Yeah, I don't... I didn't play Final Fantasy IX, but I watched my sister's boyfriend play through it when I was really young. He really liked that one. I think I was playing like seven at the time. Uh huh. All right. Lionheart F25, and here Green are across the, the board, 113 kilometers per hour, 1400 meters in length, five air time counts, five seconds of air time. Let's go. Oh, hold the phone. Hold that phone. Uh. Ring, ring, bring, bring. Please hold. Is that path going through the supports? Oh no! Wow, freaking Wii U, guys. Wow. That is an incredible coaster. Amazing triggered events. The water mm. splashing, everything. The explosions. So many cool things. Now, uh, somebody asked, is this, we were talking about FF8 and 9, but this is an FF8 creation. Um, I, I always like Zanatu's creation. I don't know. They... I, I like it, but you know what? It's giving me heavy Jurassic Park vibes. I do not see the Final Fantasy here. <laughs> like, the, you literally have Jurassic Park gates with the warning signs. You have... It, it, crocodiles jumping out at us uh like electric fences i i could you could put this in a jurassic park park and uh i wouldn't be able to tell the difference no offense it's just that's how what the that's the vibes i'm getting now i haven't really played enough of uh, final fantasy 8 where he did say something about this is uh the um the balm garden training center so this could be mm -hmm. replicating that quite well but i would have to see it to you know Put the correlation yeah. together 
so oh yeah okay In but the sign the sign species. gives me yeah. ff vibes for sure Definitely. boom cool. lionheart i love the sign really good job that coaster was phenomenal by the way Next Good up one, is Shay. the Black Knight, created by Hyrax Nexus. Wait, we wanted to see a cinematic view on that, didn't we? Oh, yeah. Let's do that. Let's do that real quick. Fire it up, Zell. Fire it up. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Pause close. Pause close. Let's go. Cinematic. That's, not, that's not what I meant to Thank do. Uh, maybe yeah. not on this train. No. Maybe on this, this sure. one. Sure. Sure, mate. Let's go. Cinematic, yeah, very nice, very nice. Damn, some really amazing shots on the cinematic. I'm loving it. Right out of the get-go, the first water splash. It's great. Really cool. I love a good cinematic coaster. If it's done right, like this. Holy crap. I was almost preferred in cinematic. There's so much going on. <laughs> All right, well done. Let's move on to the next coaster. We have... Uh, the Black Knight, created by Hyrax Nexus, a builder and a Ruby patron. Thank you so much for your tremendous Ooh, support. Thank you. And here they say, a long forgotten, a place faded from memory, a guarded, a guardian undefeated. Now he rides again with vengeance. Beware the Black Knight. This hybrid coaster is fed. That was all caps. So, uh, <laughs> It's like your face. The hybrid coaster is a fantasy themed roller coaster with green, all green stats. <laughs> it's a like green across the board. Do you have the courage to face the foe? Welcome back, Johnny. I love these messages. This is like I sure love February. it. It's so fun. Uh, I'm, wow. I'm glad you're back on your feet and feeling better. Oh. <laughs> Uh, here's one of my Jeremy newer creations, Knight. the Black Knight. <laughs> Feedback is always welcome and keep up the great work, Hyrex Nexus. Thank you. Wow. It's good to be back. It's good, good to, to be, be back. back. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, well, so much let's go through the queue. Maybe. Um, where though? Where though? It's uh, not over there. Oh, it's in here. So janky with the camera. Yeah, because oh, here smooth it is. motions, smooth motions. We need no, to put no, Zell in camera motion. training again. There oh, we no. go. Come on. Nope. <laughs> okay, we need some uh, ambient speakers in here, you guys. Get your ambient speakers going. That, that's the. This is. Well, I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a standard for 2021, guys. Disqualified. No ambient speakers. Definitely. If this jiggly puffs, jiggly puffs, this... wrong email, <laughs> wrong email. Ooh, we did daytime or nighttime? Uh, we could do both, but I think that it's because it's an RMC, it stretches over the jungle. There's probably gonna be no lighting out there, so maybe poke your head out first. Um, maybe just the lift. Yeah, there's no lighting other than the lift. Oh. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And music, music makes the people come together. Great. Okay, Mela's Unchained, and here are the results. Nice. As he and mentioned, then... it's... What did he say it? <laughs> it's, it's all green stats. All green stats, you guys. 100 kilometers per That's hour, great. five inversions, five airtime counts. Let's go. Perfect. Oh, no. No. There we go. All right.
I do not believe for a second that that was 100 kilometers per hour. Good googly moogly. <laughs> <clears throat> that coaster had a little bit of jank. A uh, little bit of jank here and there, and it did not feel like it was going 100 yeah. miles an hour. It was stalling. That coaster barely made it back to the station. <laughs> Where was this? Uh, this one roll was a bit neck breaking. Yes, that net breaking. That was so random, out of nowhere. Yeah, the, and some of the banky transitions were a little bit janky. I think this is one of their fir very first creations. I mean, oh, I mean Hyrex. I, I think it was fun. Like the coaster layout is good. It just needs some refinement. Yeah. It needs some refinement throughout the, the way. <clears throat> right, have a good night, Kurt. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks, coaster Kurt. needs some tweaks, but quite general is nice. That's right, Darg. Most parts yeah, were not cool. that janky. You know, yeah, it's, it had some jank, is what I said. Yeah. No, no. overall pretty good, though. Uh, Hyrax Nexus, the Black Knight. Really cool. Big coaster. 100 kilometers. It's a big footprint. It's only about 60 miles per hour. Is it? Yeah. Huh. Well, that's disappointing. <laughs> okay. Next up, the tortoise and the hare by Chappy Chapsoul to Jebsoul, a master builder, a silver patron, a supporter of the show. Thank you so much for your support, Chappy boy. Thank you. And here they say, hey, oh, Johnny. Inspired by a number of kitty coasters on the workshop, I decided to take on the story of the tortoise and the hare. Jump into this coaster experience and race between the two of them. Keep up the good work, Chappie. Boom. All right. Look at the uh, garden work here. It's cool. Anyway. But not me. But not me. The tortoise Show and the hare. I mean, me. you can't go up the wrong queue there. <laughs> Wow, this is yeah, ancient. You're, Chappie's you're in the chat. Uh, Amazing. Yeah, and here are the results. There they are. We got to go to the back of the train. The very back pop-up view. All right. Let us go. Super, Finish. super cute. It's super, right. super cute. Wow, freaking we! Let's uh, let's poke around at some of these creatures, huh? Sure. <laughs> I love the little finish line as well. Wow, and we got Chapsoul in the house. That's great. Seeing you in chat one, two years later, still kicking about. Love it. Look at the little crown on the turtle. Amazing. <laughs> Love the characters on this one, yeah. They're really well done. <laughs> the eyes. So like mischievous. <laughs> cool. The uh like the head hedge work is mesmerizing. <clears throat> Three three hundred fifty hedges. Yeah, no big deal. Perfect <laughs> perfect circle. I don't know how you pull that Great. off. Really well done, Chappie. Okay, the last one of the day, or of the episode. Uh, Jogger Dive Coaster by Lapuska, an advanced builder. Mm -hmm. And here they say, hello, Channel 5 Gaming. This castle used to be home to the royal family. Now uses house, now, now it houses, how do you say that? Am I saying that right? Jogger? Jogger? A thousand meter long dive coaster. Some modifications had to make the castle a to nice. better house the coaster's twisty track. Uh, coaster contains four inversions, one of them being a huge vertical loop and some integration with the queue and flat ride spin to win. Best experiences at nighttime. I hope you enjoy. Ooh, look at that ramp mm. there. That looks cool. Spin looks, to win. Uh, really cool. Mm-hmm. Loving that. Yeah. Spin to win. Riding up the coaster walls. Spin a little bit of sp win. Splatoon going on here. What's all the splatters? Yeah. Wow. Uh, let's get in here. Uh, have you ever played Army Man? Mm-hmm. It was so cool. All right. 
I love it. Ooh. It's from Toy Story, Toy Story, right? Uh, what? What's from Toy Story? Army Man. No, that's included in Toy Story. Yeah, that's what I mean. But then they made a game. No, I'm, I I think... To, I don't know. Hmm. I love the game. And it came out with another a new one. Not so long ago. It wasn't that great. Uh, wicked uh, Broughton guy, you have to uh, fill out the registration. There should be like a new member's lounge. You fill out a form. Ferran is going to take care of you. There you go. I think we did it right. Yep, we did. Great. Boop, 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 And here are the results. There they are. Five inversions. What's the biggest drop? 41 meters. Wah, wah, wah. Bigger God. dives. Bigger dives. <laughs> there it is. Middle seat, please, Jerry. Of course, Jerry. All right, here we go. Coffee! Coffee! Is that. Do you have a shop music on or is that a, a billboard? Where's it coming from? Oh my god. What the world? I really Coffee. liked. Um. um the view from here actually no it's cool there's some really yeah there's some uh, pretty cool elements here you know? right i do not understand the gulpy oh. though no i mean never but whatever whatever <laughs> some... four oh, exactly thousand okay. pieces i love that wall riding thing going across the right? castle walls this was it's a, great castles are hard nice to do view. and you did a, a pretty good job here i'm loving it like this was great. The coaster wasn't in a hurry. Oh. You're right, Dark. It was pretty slow. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like these dive coasters, we gotta make them. We gotta. You gotta set them as high as they can be, but then bring them underground and give us a, a 60, 70 meter dive, and then you get them some speed going on that. That was cool. Good, I good. Like <clears throat> All right, that was the oh. last creation of the fantasy, fantasy blueprint bundle, you guys. Five amazing creations. And we're going to be moving on the next episode to Alpine. Woo!